everyone, what's up and welcome to the channel. Right now we do have a very exciting video for all of you. We have some new leaks regarding Season 8. A new legendary soldier, a new mythic, we also have weapon inspection finally coming to the game and more. So make sure to watch the full video. And obviously guys, if you're new around here, make sure to smack that sub button and join the family. But anyways, in the background, you guys can see weapon inspection finally viewable in the game and this is so exciting because we have been waiting and asking for this forever so to see it in the game is just an amazing sight i'm really pumped for this now obviously we can see some of it is still a little bit buggy some guns are kind of bugged out some of the gun isn't showing but again just to see this coming to the game is so freaking awesome and now we can finally have like an awesome view of our mythic, our legendary, or our epic skins in game, or just the gun in general, and I'm super happy about that. So what do you guys think about this? Weapon inspection finally coming to COD Mobile sometime in the future. Amazing to see. Now moving on guys, over here we can see we are going to have a new rank known as Grand Master and you're going to be able to enter this rank from 6001 up until 8000 rank score and then Legendary will now be from 8001 rank score. So a little bit of a new challenge over here in ranked, awesome to see what do you guys think about that. And then moving on, our new Legendary Soldier sometime in the future is going to be Legendary Gunzo. And I am so excited to see how the Soldier skin is actually going to be looking because they can do some crazy stuff with Gunzo the Clown. That should be pretty epic. We're also going to have a new Mythic for Season 8 and that is going to be the M13 for Runner. And also a new Legendary is going to be the DLQ33 Advanced Artillery. So yeah, we have some new skins coming to the game. We don't know how they look just yet, but we do now know they are coming to the game. Now, this is super exciting to see. We might be getting seven days and seven nights for Undead Siege, because as we can see over here, it does say seven days. And as we do know, a few days ago, the Chinese version of the game did say they're planning a more difficult version of Undead Siege for the future. So potentially, we might be getting seven days and seven nights, which is awesome to see. We also have this new Weapon Prestige type of system which is unlocked once you have hit the max level for a particular gun and then you can view this page over here for that gun which displays the gun, the amount of kills you have on that gun, your precise kills, your most kills and your most kill streaks as well. Now over here is a description of this mode. Weapon proficiency system unlocks when any primary weapon levels up to the max level. Players can earn proficiency points by playing matches with the primary weapon. When proficiency points reach the milestone of 400, 1000 or 2000, players will respectively get a reward of a calling card, a frame and a dynamic calling card exclusively to this weapon. When 3500 proficiency points are reached, weapon rename function of that weapon will be unlocked so you'll actually be able to rename that gun once you hit the max level of proficiency, which is 3,500. Now, in the background, you guys can see all of the different details and rules regarding weapon proficiency or weapon prestige for this whole new system. And how do you guys feel about this new system? I've got to say, I am pretty intrigued. I love grinding, and this is going to add like a whole new layer for grinding different weapons in the game to get calling cards, get different frames, and the ability to actually rename your gun and maybe some other rewards as well it definitely does sound pretty intriguing now also guys the katana has finally became its own unique weapon in the game meaning we're now going to be able to grind camos for the katana which is amazing and obviously it's now its own weapon and no longer just a skin which is great to see so anyway guys that is going to be all for this video i hope all of you guys did enjoy it if you did make sure to smack that sub button and join the family as well as hitting that like button and giving your opinion down below in the comment section so anyways have a great day and cheers